so I have kind of been looking for some good outward videos to kind of just zone out and go to sleep to. And I found a, a, a few videos that definitely get the job done. But I figured, you know what? Why not just make some of my own? So that's what we'll do. So, we don't really have a use for the, the iron scraps, but we can get some tourmaline or rubies. So this is one half of my... Uh, money running um, the the end game of outward is like this town building kind of uh, not really mini game but I, I haven't delved into it yet because it uh, apparently requires a, a fair amount of gold, around 200 gold to start. Oh, boo. Is this also not ready? I've rested like five freaking days. This can be mined at least. What's really gonna suck is if I get to the Conflux Mountain path and everything is still not respawned. Because those mana stones, that's, that's where I make my money. some blue sand? No. Well, plenty of uh, azure shrimp. sand doesn't bode well. But I can still se uh, sell those shrimp. I think they're like nine silver a piece. So that ain't bad.
So I'll run down the beach here. Usually gathering up blue sand, but see it off in the distance there, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't have a good feeling. I need to start recharging that mana as well. All right, what you gonna be? Shrimp? Nothing. Just, <laughs> just a straight up fake out. What's the uh, is that sunrise? Light is still good. So now any padded armor we pick up we can uh, make into amylite armor. I want to zap anything from a distance. Occasionally you'll see a uh, Wendigo pop up over here. This will kind of be our giveaway as to whether or not whether or not this is going to be profitable. Is that something in the distance? What do we think that is? Nothing. Pearl bird, maybe. Big nothing. So now we'll get up this hill. As long as the uh, mana vein is mineable here, well, we will gather some resources. Success. Uh, then we got this over here. <coughs> get a tourmaline out of that. Now we got a little mini boss down in this region, but may not may not have uh, respawned yet. But we'll see. If the ornate chests haven't. This guy probably has not either, but 
we'll find out. Nope. Okay. Well, now, now we can focus on the easy stuff. So we're going to go up to the top of the Conflux Mountain. Going to get all the mana stones. That we can. Uh, and Hackmanite. Hackmanite, is that what I'm, is that what it is? We'll see. If we get a piece, we'll see. Uh, that's, that's the big money. Um. <clears throat> yeah, we don't need, don't need any more of that at the moment. So we got a little hidden guy over here. Yeah, Hackmanite. And we did, yeah, we picked up a fresh mining pick, so whenever this one breaks, we'll just drop it. Uh, okay, so we're not going in there yet. That will be where we actually go to... complete the mountain path. So once we get to the inside of the mountain, we'll take a boat that will dump us out at Vendeville Fortress. And there's a couple, couple little things we can pick up there, but not a lot that will there are a, a couple chests on the inside but again, nothing nothing really extravagant, we'll say. Um, there are a couple enemies inside the, uh, the mountain path here that I also want to make sure <clears throat> that we uh, find them and kill them they will drop elemental particles, particularly ether, ether elemental particles. And that's what I need now to do the rest of my enchanting for the armor I wear.
All right, mining pick broke. And drop it. Uh, and there's also another big iron vein. Because uh, that tourmaline is also... Nice. It's three Hackmanites so far, I think. Oh, yeah. Should have left that gold. Uh, you alive? Never quite tell. Fern. Another mana stone. Now there is a boss right there, but I'm not not in boss fight mode. I'm in gather resources mode. Still got about 40, 40 units to pick up. I don't pick the term ups up very much. Uh, it's way easier to just buy the term up pottage uh, for that mana regen. And even there, I I assume Ocean Fricassee is the better item anyway. this so there are three different pathways to get to the inside of the conflux mountain um, I think the uh, what is it blue something Probably the easiest. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Is everything not respawned yet? I don't poop. Oh, well, that's. That's what we wanted to kill. Uh, okay, well. If I can still mine everything. What's going on with this chest? All right, well, that's a bummer. Um, but again, hopefully I can, if I can gather the materials, uh, mana stones, a hackmanite, all of that. I'm not necessarily trying to uh, keep combat to a minimum. I'd say more uh, uh, 
I, I wouldn't think anything I'd come across in anything I do for these little Zen playthroughs. Uh, nothing should really be that intense. But every once in a while, you come across some the blue chamber, blue chamber. Um, with us just in just for fun and we'll see if any any bad guys spawn Oop, still dead but Okay, we can get the mana stones. I mean, ultimately, it's kind of all I care about. Well, that's not true. I, I really did want to... Uh, okay, hug the left. Hug the left. Definitely seems like the uh, chests have not respawned, but the what would you call these? this uh why is this combat music Ooh, guess I left a little little trog alive well here we go okay we still got some battle music going on. Is this where I was? Ooh, hello. You ain't bad. Love those varnish recipes. They are never not useful. Stones. Cross fingers for that Hackmanite. Okay, ghost. Get get out of my way. Oh, ghost. Oh, ghost. Oh my god. Th this is the worst thing ever. Ugh. <gasps>
see right there again that's the that's the enemy we're looking to kill they dropped the elemental particles but they are difficult to kill when they are already dead It's not bad. 200 silver. Tough to complain about that. Pick up those star mushrooms. I just have I have too many mana potions as is. So they're really just not doing me doing me any good. Get that. I think we got one more on the other side. Why is this fight music? Alright, I'm pretty sure it would not have respawned, but just to be on the safe side, we're gonna kind of power up a little bit. say I picked up uh, enough to sell there but uh, what do you got that boiled turnip I don't even know when I picked that up hmm. oh okay that's not my inventory all right The uh, chests have not um, respawned, then I'm sure the one here in Vendable has not either. So I'm just going to take advantage of the daylight and. Back to Chirsonese. I 
imagine most of the baddies have not respawned either. something good. No. Okay. Next time. Occasionally. I'm kind of shocked. I haven't seen... Oh. It's still dead too. It's nuts. This stuff has taken so long to repopulate. I don't know. That that's uh, kind of a weird thing about Outward, because there there literally be times I'll finish fighting a, a little duo of bandits, and then turn the camera around, and another duo has <laughs> spawned in behind me. So that way has an altar for something DLC related that I don't care to uh, take the time to learn. However, I, I do think it's a little bit shorter to, uh, cause this is going to take us kind of full circle back to the beach where the fake out blue sand was oh, seven silver don't mind if I do alright so not a way to go through there but there is a way down through here There is a path to go around like this mountain range and get back to the uh, the, the path to Chirsenese, but uh, yeah, we'll just keep with the tartines. Probably need to drink one more time before getting back. burnt stamina off. So I made about three gold. Um, having more of the chests to do and, and even just getting stuff off of off of the enemies will usually make that run uh, a bit more lucrative um, and again even if nothing else just trying to get uh, well that that is the nice the other nice thing about those elementals like <laughs> if you don't get a, a particle from them it's like six or eight mana stones so kind of a win-win but I, I do definitely want to get more of those elemental particles uh, oh hello we always uh, always want to kill them that uh that movement speed increase with the pearl bird mask and then we just hang a left and boom we're back at Chirsenese right up to sunset to the 
about an in-game day to to uh, go up the beach, up the mountain, into the mountain, and uh, you know, back down the beach. So it's a that's a full full circle run. I'll probably is there anything I even need to sell? No. Um, I'll be doing these runs for a while again, just getting gold, accruing gold. Uh, so I'll I'll keep doing these here and there, and just make a nice Zen ASMR playlist. <laughs>